sewage, alien forestation and an illegal dumping ground is what has become of the once relaxing and welcoming park and dam of Morocco in Soweto. The community says the sewage is unbearable and the dam itself has become a crime hub for criminals to do their dirty tricks. With previously incidents of dead bodies being dumped in what was once an area where people would sit and relax, residents say that they don't feel safe being near Morocco Dam. Katazagila umpaga ati wase moroka eso weto. Nyo si mo seta mesel pendu genda woye mfukuza. Ka nyene zinda seskebe gum. Hoi saka muzi no tlale tuze netamu. Utege se sisi deska tibe kalaza nyo si mo seta mu. Kota luto ushinjo. Lias afekta kakulu. Lias afekta kakulu kakulu. Uwes minang opposite nalo. Number one, you know, Number two, go fell um to Anna, Lana, Lisha, Lazy, says it says his name, Gakul, but to Bulelum to no man was called with scholar, Ribam Ripabam to Bulela, and as I faggy complain with Lisha, Lazy, Masi are full because as second safe, in Kala opposite now, Lucent Kala and Kil, Mangsu Puma Gunga Koba and Tulanga, but near Saba Nam. Meanwhile, the city of Johannesburg says it is aware of the horrendous state of Morocco Dam. It says there are plans and projects in place that will address the problem. Residents are also urged to avoid littering river streams. In terms of the current status, um, Historically, this is not the first time that we've had this kind of thing where we had significant vegetation growth uh, that criminals used as hideouts and began committing robberies to park users and other dwellers. So in terms of the complaints that we received from the community regarding the uh, unpleasant smell, that is down to the vegetation cover on the entire surface of the dam that has limited dissolved oxygen. Uh, levels. So currently um, I just want to state that this is a reputation every five to ten years you are going to get um, manifestation of these kind of challenges due to the urban pressures uh, that are coming from the upstream uh, catchment. In terms of the sewer systems for the city without abuse from the communities and without the foreign material that they put into the sewer systems you would not have these challenges that we have right now at the dam. So we'd like to appeal to the community to um, not abuse the sewer infrastructure systems because uh, the sewer systems are at the downstream point. So you're always going to see the impact in the watercourses and dams. So currently the plans that we have are multifold. One is the operation and maintenance from Johannesburg Water in terms of uh, sewer patrols to detect and resolve sewer spillages, Joburg City Parks in terms of park revamp and maintenance, and also the removal and clearing of vegetation within the water body itself. Mm -hmm.